Felix the Fast Tractor and the New Building by Catherine Cannon Felix the Fast Tractor lives on Amber's farm with Farmer Story, Mrs Story, their two children Max and Lucy and the family dog Ben. Felix loves living on a farm. There is always plenty to do and lots of people around. In fact, Felix couldn't think of anywhere else that he would rather live. Felix woke early one morning, poked his blue bonnet out of the rickety barn door and sneezed. Achoo! Ben woke with a grumpy woof. Then he sneezed too. When Felix and Ben finally stopped sneezing, they noticed that Daisy the digger was in the yard. She was sitting on the back of Laurie the low loader. What are you doing here? Felix asked Daisy. I've come to do some building work, she said. How are you both? Ben and Felix both sneezed again. Achoo! Ben and I keep getting colds from sleeping in the drafty old barn, Felix replied. Farmer Story was with Mrs. Story, Max and Lucy. They were talking to Kevin the Builder, who was busy looking at a piece of paper with a large building on it. What are you going to build? Felix asked Daisy. Oh, I can't tell you that, she laughed. It's a secret. Kevin marked out a large rectangle on the ground with some small wooden posts. Then, using a can of spray paint, he painted a yellow line between the posts. He narrowly missed Ben's paws. Daisy and Felix worked quickly to get the site ready. Even though Felix had a cold, he was still a fast tractor. When the site was cleared, Tippy the tipper truck arrived. She tipped a huge heap of stones onto the ground. Tippy, do you know what the new building is for? Felix asked her. It's a secret, Tippy giggled, winking at Daisy. Soon afterwards, Cherney the cement mixer arrived. He poured concrete into the trench to make the foundations. What's the new building for? Felix asked Farmer Story. It's a secret, Felix, he laughed. That night, Felix had trouble getting to sleep. It was cold and the wind blew through the holes in the barn. As Felix shivered and sneezed, he couldn't stop wondering what Farmer Story was building. The next day, Max and Lucy watched Kevin the Builder do what he did best, build walls. Farmer Story was using a wheelbarrow to bring Kevin lots of wet and sloppy cement to fix the bricks in place. Then it was time to put on the roof. Felix watched as Daisy carefully placed the trusses on top of the walls. Kevin nailed them into place. But what is the building for? Felix asked Kevin. I can't tell you. It's still a secret, he laughed. How's it going? Farmer Story asked Kevin. I've put on the door and I'm just finishing the roof. Kevin replied. Soon he had nailed down the last slate. There, it's finished. That will keep it warm and dry, he said. Doesn't the new building look great, said Farmer Story. Yes, sniffed Felix, but what's it for? It's a brand new barn for two of my friends, said Farmer Story. Oh, said Felix, feeling a bit sad. It's for you and Ben, said Farmer Story. For us? shouted Felix with delight, forgetting all about his cough and cold. Thanks very much. It's brilliant. Felix had never been happier. He was the luckiest fast tractor in the world. That night, Felix and Ben easily fell asleep as they snuggled down in their new home. There was no wind blowing through the walls and no water dripping through the roof. The only other sound came from inside the barn. The sound of Ben softly snoring. The End Voice by Matthew Kerslake with kind permission from Catherine Cannon